Hancock is a difficult character. He doesn't seem to have any great depth to him. Yeah. Uh, he is seen to have uh, uh, played around with the truth uh, on a lot of occasions. He seems to have a number of, un you know, when even the publican at his local pub gets a contract for PPE, yeah. you have to think to yourself, this is a man who, you know, maybe he's totally without sin, but he fall, he fails the Napoleon test. Yeah. He's not a lucky general. <laughs> yeah. Napoleon said they all had to be lucky generals. Yeah. Yeah. Now, for Boris to sit there when, you know, and, and, and say that, uh, you know, as far as he's concerned, it's sort of all over, it isn't. And the danger for Boris is that his own seediness will become more of an issue because of Hancock. And at a certain point, you know, Boris has got away with an awful lot in his life, and the public quite like him, and so they forgive him. But at a certain point, the forgiveness comes to an end. Mm. And this, by both of the main contenders in all of this, Hancock does himself no favours yeah. by trying to cling on, and Boris does himself no favours by trying to cling on to Hancock. So, come on, boys, mm. cut it out.